the best nightly routine for deep, good sleep. Everyone has their own nightly routine, whether they know it or not. But what if yours isn't working anymore? That's what we're here for. Having a bedtime routine is one of the smartest and beneficial things you can do for yourself. After having a mental and or physical overdrive at work or school, it is in your bedroom where you can slow down and focus on what matters the most, and that is sleep. Poor sleep can have several health consequences. If you have a hard time getting restful sleep regularly, then it pays to create and maintain a nightly routine. By doing so, it puts your body in a relaxed time, allowing you to sleep better and longer. It may take a few nights to set in, but be patient. Many, if not most of the steps in this bedtime routine are very easy, such as setting an alarm and creating a bedtime playlist. Let's get into these steps one by one, so stick around and stay tuned. 1. Set an alarm to signal it's time to prep for bed. As part of your natural sleep-wake cycle, the brain automatically starts winding down a few hours before. Having a bedtime routine can help make the process more efficient by training the brain to feel tired when it's bedtime. First off, decide your sleep and wake up times. It's crucial to start your bedtime routine at a consistent time each night. Set an alarm or notification on your phone. It'll serve as a help signal that you should start preparing for bed. Two, spend 15 minutes preparing for tomorrow. A restless mind is a worse condition for sleep. Many of us dwell on things to do the following day the moment we're on our bed. While this can help you prepare for tomorrow, it can also keep you awake. So to solve this, create a to-do list, preferably using paper and pen. These are tasks you'll need to do in the morning that you might forget when you wake up. By having a to-do list ready, your mind is less cluttered so you can rest easy. Try to spend 15 minutes only on this. If it exceeds, then your list might be too stressful for you to create before bed. In this case, consider creating your to-do list during the day or earlier in the evening. 3. Take a shower or bath to wash off stress. A great way to reduce stress and ease tiredness and muscle tension from your body is to take a shower or bath. Do this one or two hours before bed to help lower your body temperature and promote restful sleep. Body temperature plays an important role in the sleep-wake cycle. Naturally, a human's core temperature drops before nightly sleep. According to research, taking an evening shower or bath in water between 104 and 108.5 degrees Fahrenheit improves sleep quality. What's more, those who bathe or shower one to two hours before bedtime tend to fall asleep faster. Four, jot down other thoughts in a journal. After you dress for bed, it's time to write in your diary. Journaling has been proved to benefit mental health by reducing stress and helping you remember good ideas before sleeping. You don't need to fill the pages of your diary at night. Rather, you can simply write your thoughts and emotions that you've been holding on to all day. They don't have to be properly structured and in perfect grammar. Phrases and even words will do, so long as you can put your chaotic thoughts to rest. And while doing so, you can even have something warm to at least calm your mind, which brings us to the next step in our routine. 5. Drink something warm. Now that you're done or are still journaling, drink a warm cup of tea or milk to get you further in the mood for bedtime. Chamomile tea is an excellent option as it has been used for centuries to treat sleep disorders and insomnia. If you don't like the taste of tea, drink warm milk instead to encourage sleep. For most adults, chamomile is the bedtime go-to drink. If not, you can also have turmeric. Turmeric is a superfood that aids sleep and combats inflammation and even depression. You can purchase it at a grocery store or at a local farmer's market. Turmeric can taste bitter, so you can create a bedtime concoction by adding milk to your turmeric tea to help sweeten and add flavor to your drink. Before we continue, a like would be great. 6. Turn off your electronic devices. Screens from televisions, laptops, and smartphones emit blue light. Blue light disrupts the body's internal clock or circadian rhythm, keeping you awake even when it's time to hibernate. Moreover, sleep studies have shown that exposure to large amounts of blue light before bed can lower melatonin levels, 
leading to sleeplessness and delayed REM sleep. Thus, it's recommended to turn off screens 30 to 45 minutes before sleep. When it comes to getting a complete night's rest, it's always best to draw a clear boundary between sleep and technology. Wait until the sun is up to check your Twitter or continue streaming on Netflix. 7. Relax your muscles using foam rolling or yoga. After you've put away your electronics, it's time to actively relieve tension in your body. Foam rolling is a good way to do that. It's a trigger point therapy that reduces muscle soreness and stiffness. Like a massage, it relaxes tight muscles and improves blood flow. Another option is to do yoga. Poses like downward facing dog, cat cow, and child's pose are perfect for eliminating stress from your hamstrings, shoulders, and lower back. Other yoga poses are also great on loosening muscles that you didn't know were tight. For best results, listen to your bedtime playlist while doing yoga, which brings us to the next step. 8. Play your bedtime playlist. Listening to bedtime songs can help you let go of mental attachments. Based on psychology studies, listening to music helps promote sleep and enhance sleep quality. Classical music in particular has been found to aid sleep. However, you don't need to force yourself to listen to a specific genre. You can also venture out to R&B, jazz, or bossa nova. Any music is fine as long as it helps you sleep soundly. Color noises can also help, which are audio-engineered sound waves made to interact with the brain. White noise, example, the sound of a fan or humidifier. Pink noise, example, the sound of rainfall or the first snow. And brown noise, example, the sound of the ocean, are all examples of color noises. They work to help slow thoughts and dissolve anxiety. 9. Lower the lights and thermostat. Before getting inside the covers, make sure to turn off or lower bright lights. Bright lights can affect the circadian rhythm. A cozy and dark sleeping environment puts your internal body clock into sleep mode. In addition, don't forget to lower the thermostat to 65 degrees. It's an ideal temperature for good sleep. Your body will soon adapt to the reduced room temperature and you'll start to feel drowsy. 10. Get in your bed and sleep. And for the last and final step, simply get inside the cover and drift off. Be consistent with your routine, and once you've made it into a habit, sleep should come to you as natural as breathing. Other calming activities you can try. Doing soothing activities can help you sleep better. Consider doing the following activities. Read a good book. Practice deep breathing for relaxation. To do it, inhale through the nose and exhale through the mouth. Count your breaths and start back at one if you lose count. Try aromatherapy using lavender and cedar essential oils, for instance. However, aromatherapy and essential oils may not be for everyone, especially for people sensitive to smells or are allergic. Perform 10 minutes of meditation. Diet tips to promote better sleep. Avoid eating large meals two to three hours before bed and drinking alcohol, including wine, before bed. If you're hungry, opt for light healthy snacks such as oatmeal, nuts, fruits, and yogurt. Complex carbs like those foods trigger the release of the sleep hormone serotonin. Moreover, they don't take long to digest. Don't consume caffeine late in the day. Better yet, don't consume caffeine up to six hours before bed. Caffeine can stay elevated in the blood for six to eight hours. Thus, Drinking large amounts of coffee after 3 to 4 p.m. isn't recommended. Avoid eating spicy foods within three hours of bedtime, as they can cause heartburn, which in turn impacts your sleep. So, what about you? How's your bedtime routine compared to ours? Try this nightly routine to see if it works for you. Let us know what happens in the comment section below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel. Here are two more videos you should check out, both of them will definitely help you reach your goals.